I took a bus to Mexico. I was 20. I just finished high school in New York. And uh, the man I was in love with, I didn't want the responsibility of being the first man in my life. So I took a bus with $10 in my pocket to Mexico, which was stolen on the way. And when I arrived in Mexico, I had absolutely no money. So I went out on the street begging to get money. I came here to study Spanish over the summer, but then decided to stay. I would spend Sundays at Plaza Garibaldi with the mariachi musicians. I would go to different people's homes on Sundays. And that's how I really became acquainted with the Mexican people. I also took singing lessons and a very famous Mexican actor and singer took lessons with the same teacher. And because he wanted me, he wanted to make love to me, but he thought that a good way to get closer to me would be to give me a part in a big musical production he was doing in a cabaret. As a slave of the queen, uh, I was dancing in a bikini, uh, wearing very revealing outfits, and I got so much attention that the star of the play was jealous and she decided to kick me out of the show. Because of all the publicity I got because of that, I was hired to star in the next production. But I was terrible. I wasn't really prepared to be a star, you know. And I remember falling flat on my back in a can-can dance number. I sang with a very bad voice. Very often people would not even applaud when I was singing. But there I was, just, you know, kicking it off. And, and, and people would come because of my, basically because of my charisma and outspokenness. <laughs> 